I met a drummer, a very talented young drummer in a band from another school. And so I was really into Buddy at that time. Yeah. He said to me, who's your favorite drummer? So I said, uh, my favorite drummer is Buddy Rich. But he, I said to him in response, who's your favorite drummer? <laughs> and he just said, Tony Williams. Oh my gosh. Oh, I said, who's that? You know, I didn't know and he told me. So the next day I went to a record store and of all the things that could possibly happen, there was a, a, a physical album of a Tony Williams called Ego Absolutely. hanging on the wall. <laughs> like it was waiting for me. Yeah. So I went, oh, that's that guy. You know, and I picked it up and I bought it. I go home and I put the record on and I could make heads or tails. It was like Greek. It, it was so different and so eclectic to me that I couldn't make heads or tails. But, but, but rather than just go, oh, this sounds horrible, I just, I, I thought, I felt stymied because I didn't understand it. Right, right. And I thought, I want to understand this. And again, for no good reason at all, the next day, I put it on again. Light bulb moment number two. <laughs> it was like an instant. You got it. I got it. Wow. And I just thought, it was like the sky opened. 